Hello there, welcome along to New Tinto Park, home of Rangers Ladies this campaign. And we're with you for SWPL1 highlights. It is Rangers against Glasgow City back in league action after both these two were in League Cup duty in the semi-final last week. Rangers lost to Hibs by four goals to one. City won narrowly against Aberdeen. Well, looking at the team news, they had to strengthen rather heavily did Rangers over the winter period as they were rather light in numbers at the end of the 2015 campaign. They look stronger, they're currently in second place at the table. Rhonda Jones is a former Glasgow City player, of course, very experienced, 37 years old, and she's in the heart of the defence, and they do have a bit of quality up front with Katie Turner up there. Lisa Swanson may well feature later on from the bench. For Glasgow City, the one change of note from last weekend's win against Aberdeen is that Lorna Murchie has been moved to centre-half. There's no Cheryl McCulloch today. Fiona Brown comes in, Risha Littlejohn and pushes into the central midfield role alongside Joe Love. And it looks like Clear Shine tucking in behind Julie Fleeting once again. And there is a few youngsters on the bench looking to get some more game time, including Brogan Hay and Sam Kerr, when we will see them later on. Hayley Lauder is also back on the bench. Well, these two met at New Tinto Park last game of last season. It was 10-0 to Glasgow City. Rangers stronger this time, but City started well with Brown's ball in. Shine there. Not a million miles away. Lively old start from Claire Shine. Eight goals in all competition so far. Little John. Brown. Ross out wide, but Brown's going to cut in here. Have a strike! Not far away. Johnson had it covered, though. And City trying to rack up the chances. Fleeting for Little John. Brown. Rossi's ball. There's Cuthbert and... Rhonda Jones gets in the way, former Glasgow City player. I don't know if it maybe came off her arm, I don't think so, but cleared anyway. Little John. Cuthbert. Brown on the chase. Fleeting in there, there's Little John in there. They just try and get it away and do through McClintock. And they survive that skate. Turner trying to get further away. A wonderful ball in. And a bit of a scramble. Eventually, once they get it away, it's still 0 0. Before it goes here, and here's Brown trying to get behind McCarthy. Here comes Faye coming out. And a little cart coming together. Fee will be okay. Brown's back to her feet. First real life of a threat in the final third of the pitch for Rangers. Forward again here for Brown. Chantel Brown. Snatched that a little bit, never had much else on. A couple of little chances in the last few minutes, half chances. Rangers not too happy. They thought it was their throw. Leon Ross gets on with it for City. Brown. Now, Brown cutting in, and there's Fleeting, oh Johnson, that's a superb save from the Rangers keeper, right at her, had to get fingertips and then hold it, that may well have been 1-0, big chance. Brown getting forward again. Fiona Brown's in a terrific first half. Here's Ross. There's Fleeting there in again. A couple of headers over the last minute. Johnson collects once more. Pressure building. McCarthy. Or oh, shining little John. Space here for Doherty. On the challenge in from Foley. It's a free kick to City in a good spot here. 
Thank you, Doc. Everything down there, having a laugh, claiming for a penalty. <laughs> All in good humour. There's Ross to take. Clipton for fleeting! And they may well have taken an echo of Ronda Jones in there. Fleeting claims it 1 0 Glasgow City. Well, I'm pretty sure Ronda Jones got the decisive touch. Fleeting doesn't care. Glasgow City don't care. In the right spot again. It was a cute free kick. Another free kick chance. It's clever again for Shine. And McMurchie coming in towards the back, trying to ghost in. Rangers survive there, but another clever free kick from Leon Ross and almost poverty for a second goal. Doherty for Brown. Flick for Little John! Another fantastic stop from Claire Johnston. Sun still out beaming. And Cuthbert has been bright. Drags that a little bit though. Really has enjoyed a more roving role as Evan Cuthbert. And Jones will go back to our keeper Johnson. Great first half. Spin his keeper. Under pressure here from Shine. Oh, Shine gets something in there a bit like the game last week. And there's Cuthbert! Outstanding! Against a former club, and there is Aaron Cuthbert. Sixth goal of the season in all competitions. More than she got last campaign. What a finish. Brown almost trips, but she's going to get the shot away. Know what she can do from that sort of range, but taken by Johnson. Covered well since the mistake a few minutes ago. Cuthbert. Little John. The lead down. Here's Kerr! Oh. Just off the bench, and a decent try from Sam Kerr, looking for a first city goal. Johnson again with the save. John McCarthy still getting it going Ronda Jones with the challenge McCarthy down advantage here Brown Cuthbert tapping 3-0 Aaron Cuthbert with 2 this afternoon and in the summer S sunshine Aaron Cuthbert now with 7 goals with 4 of those in the league top goal scorer for City in the league now Great afternoon for her. And with that Erin Cuthbert goal, along with the fact that Julie Fleeting's goal appears to be given as hers by the referee, this current 2016 crop of City players between them have 550 goals in the orange jersey. Incredible. Shine does really well to get away from McClintock. O'Neill with a challenge, but here's Lauder. What a flick. Brown! Stop. Jones trying to get away. There's Shine this time. And Johnson with another sensational save. Double save, really. Johnson trying a little bit hurt on the floor, but they look okay. Little John. Ross trying to clip it in. Brogan A leaves it for Kerr, who... Spins at it, goes away from go. Lively from Kerson's coming on. Fully under pressure from Brogan Hay and Savannah McCarthy. Now Little John, Cuthbert. Little John gets it back now. Brogan Hay for Carla Boyce. Easy enough for the keeper, but good to see the two young players combined in. Carla Boyce scored her first league goal here in that 10 0 win at the end of last season. Final whistle, game over, and a terrific performance from Glasgow City. They really bossed the chances and took three goals superbly.
I hear from the referee that Julie Fleeting has been officially given the goal, although I do suspect Ronda Jones got the final touch, but Fleeting's been given it by the referee, Jennifer Carberry. And then two goals from Aaron Cuthbert in the second half in the 58th minute and the 71st minute. And the second one was a great strike, although there was a little bit of a defensive mistake. But a tap in for our third, a double for Cuthbert, and really is. Strider away with the goals, just one off Claire Shine's eight tally so far this season. Really has been a great start to the season for Cuthbert and for Glasgow City. They march on with another three points. Do check out all the uh, analysis and the uh, interviews and other clips from the game on our YouTube page. And we'll have highlights of the next league game. It's a Monday night game at the Excelsior against Stirling University. But the final score here, Rangers nil, Glasgow City 3.